Make no mistake, what Gagoro are doing will 100% change the entire world landscape when it comes to transportation. And I cannot, I cannot emphasize this highly enough. What they are doing absolutely is revolutionary and no one is really talking about it. Honestly, it's truly shocking. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. I'm the Electric Viking. Great to have you here. I spoke recently about what Gagoro are doing with their swappable batteries. In other words, to quickly explain what's happening, by the end of this year, there will be more battery swapping stations from the one brand called Gagoro in Taiwan than there are petrol stations or gas stations, which is insane. Because I lived in Taiwan for a year and I can tell you now, there are gas stations everywhere. And I mean, there's a lot of them, but Gagoro are building out their battery swapping stations so quickly that they're going to overtake that number, potentially even by the middle of this year. Why does that matter? Well, people in Taiwan, people in Southeast Asia, people in China, in other words, billions of people, people in India, probably more than half the world's population, love using scooters, but in particular, scooters. So this means that more than half the world's population will eventually have access to low cost transportation, which is extremely convenient. Think about this, right? The batteries, you can swap the battery out of your vehicle in like less than a minute and it actually automates the entire process. You don't have to walk into the store and pay. The app actually handles it all for you. So it's incredibly convenient, right? You can just drive wherever you are, pull over at any moment, I mean, considering these stations are everywhere, swap out your battery in less than a minute. It's way faster than putting petrol in your car and walking in to pay for it or putting petrol in your scooter, walking in to pay for it. Swap that out and you're on your way again. And you know what? You're not sitting in your own fumes because think about it when you're on a motorbike and that exhaust is spitting out fumes. You're not sucking in those fumes, are you? So it's a massive advantage. There's no noise. It's quiet. It's efficient. It's cheaper than running a petrol-powered ice-powered scooter or motorbike. It's brilliant. It's a brilliant solution. Well, now Gagora have just completely changed the game. Not only are they expanding into India at a rapid rate and into Southeast Asia at a rapid rate and into China, they're also now bringing out a solid state battery version. Insane. This thing apparently is going to increase the energy density of their current swappable batteries by 140%. I'm telling you now, this is absolutely revolutionary. I'm so excited because it's going to totally change the world of transportation. You know what? Most people don't really need a car. But that said, if you're driving around in a city, I can tell you right now, it is so much quicker in 90% of the world's cities. So much easier to just ride a scooter and an electric one which is easier to drive, better to drive, more efficient and cheaper to run is such a brilliant solution for more than half the world's population. On March the 8th of 2022, Gagoro pulled the wraps off another project it's been working on. And if this lives up to what we think it will, it will be an enormous deal. The biggest deal of any news that I can possibly bring to you this year. Gagoro has been working with Prologium Technology to develop what is calling the world's first swappable solid state battery. It is intended for use in its electric vehicles. By the way, there's already millions of those on the roads. So it's perfect because guess what? It works with all of those existing vehicles that are already on the roads. It's intended for use, of course, in Gagoro's electric scooters backwards compatible with their existing electric fleet, which by the way, is by far the largest fleet in the world. The advantage of, of solid state lithium ceramic batteries include two things that EV enthusiasts will, will want. They're highly valuable, higher energy density and greater range. According to Gagoro's claims, its new solid state battery packs will hold an increased capacity of 140%, like I mentioned before. So what that means is their batteries are going to go from 1.7 kilowatt hours to 2.5 kilowatt hours packed in the same exact swappable battery. These cases will neatly slide into PBGN electric scooters and will be available at their GO stations, which like I said, are more plentiful in Taiwan this year than gas stations. And the same thing is going to happen all over the world. This trend is just going to go crazy all over Southeast Asia, over India. It's brilliant. I love it. 
Gagora is unveiling the world's first solid state battery for two wheel battery swapping because it's imperative we take advantage of the latest innovations to introduce a new era of electric transportation growth and adoption in our cities. That's what was said by Gagora founder chairman and CEO Horace Luke. We partner with Prologium Tech, a global leader in solid state battery innovation, to jointly develop this new battery that delivers higher energy density for better range, improved stability and safety, and it is reverse compatible with all existing Gagora powered vehicles. As leading global battery innovators, Gagora and Prologium have partnered to jointly design solid state battery prototypes that integrate with Gagora's battery swapping network and two wheel vehicles. Prologium technology founder and CEO Vincent Yang added, Solid state battery technology presents a new phase in the future of electric vehicles, and we look forward to advancing this Gagora prototype battery into a commercial offering in the near future, Yang said. Gagora had a really busy year last year. It's not slowing down though. It's improving its power options it can offer its customers. It's improving its app. It's increasing its battery stations. It's expanding globally. It's crazy. And it's significantly increasing its customer base every day of the week. It's by far the most popular electric mobility solution now in the world. Personally, I think every state government, every single government in the world should be asking Agora to come to their country, implement the plans that they've already implemented in Taiwan and are implementing throughout the Asian world and that we should all adopt this technology it's amazing i absolutely love it i think it is the best solution globally for transportation or outside of a bicycle and remember many of the people being served by gagora right now couldn't previously afford efficient or clean transportation this is changing the game entirely now i made a video about what gagora are doing globally with their battery swapping stations i'll put a link in the description below to that video make sure you check that out because that's going to give you an idea of what is really going on in the world it's not what you think it's not what you think because i strongly believe we have reached peak car and the reason we've reached peak car is because of solutions like this way cheaper to run one of these way 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 cheaper to use this system it's actually more convenient as well you don't ever have to worry about charging gagora handles all of that for you it's just a brilliant solution now let me know in the comment section below what you think am i too excited for this am i just like getting over worked up at, would you use if you had the option of using this and it was say 50 times cheaper than you going out and buying a car which is it is 50 times cheaper literally to just run one of these and to pay for it we're using the app on a daily basis. In terms of the average cost per mile, it's about 50 times cheaper. It's insane. Would you consider using that if you live in a city in the world? Would you consider using this if it was really convenient and you have to charge? You can just run into a, your local gas station, wherever that is, swap out your battery in less than a minute and away you go again. Now, I know a lot of people want cars and they wouldn't consider anything except a car. But that said, if you ride a bicycle, well, it's all that different. Let me know in the comment section below what you think. Have a good day and I'll see you again on the next video. Bye-bye.